The following two problems are simplifying square roots using the factor method. So to solve it, we have to factor 84. Uh, you might remember your multiplication tables that 84 is uh, 12 times 7, but you also could do 2 times 42. That's always a very simple way. And then you could factor 42 as 6 times 7, and then 6 is 2 times 3. So our prime factorization is 2 times 2 times 3 times 7. So we paired together the 2s. We do 84, square root of 84 is the same as square root of 2 times 2 times the square root of 3 times the square root of 7. And so, remember the factor method, you circle the pair and then you write it out front. Well, there's only one pair in this problem, so those go out front. And you're left with 3 times 7, which is 21. And so our answer is 2 times the square root of 21. As for the second problem, again, you factor. And you may not recognize anything on this one. I don't necessarily, so... I'm going to factor 2 times whatever whatever 392 divided by 2 is, which happens to be 196. Calculator can come in handy there. Or 190, yeah, 196, not 192. Now you're going to factor 196. Well, again, I know a 2 goes into it because it's even, so that's going to leave me with 98. And then I also know that a 2 goes into 98, which leaves me with 49, and I know the factorization for 49, which is 7 times 7. So I group the pairs together, 2 times 2 times 7 times 7, and then I've got a 2 left over at the end. So I'm going to have 7 times 7, and then times 2. And I go through and I circle the pairs, so I've got a pair of 2's and a pair of 7's. I remove each one of those from the uh, square root and place it out front, and so I'm going to be left with 2 times 7 times the square root of what's ever left inside, which is only just that single 2. So it turns out to be 2 times 7 is 14 times the square root of 2, and that's the correct solution.